Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to discuss about uh, security levels of uh, the power system. security levels of uh, power system we are having a uh, six levels of uh, security levels and those uh, six levels are first one level one is a uh, secure level in this uh, secure state or the secure level the load is supplied without violating any limits if we are having a, a system generating generator two generators supplying a load of a 10 megawatt we are having two generators each are uh, capacity of 5 megawatt each transmitting 5 megawatt from bus 1 to bus 2 the load is at a bus 2 in this secure state the load is supplied without violating any limits means uh, the power flow capacity of the line is not exceeded okay if it is having a maximum of 5 megawatt we are transmitting megawatt we are not uh, overloading the line here that's what we are talking about and uh, none of the contingency will cause uh, any violations on uh, system parameters these system parameters are not affected by the contingency or the fault which may occur we don't know exactly what is the fault level but if a fault occur it will not affect on the system parameters the system parameters remains uh, same this is uh, about uh, the secure level and uh, second level is uh, correctively secure second level is uh, correctively secure here also in correctively secure state all the loads are supplied whatever the load is we are supplying the whole load okay without violating any limits remember when we are talking about uh, violating the limits we are violating we are talking about violating uh, power flow voltage current level frequency and all okay since we are not violating any limits even in uh, level 2 or uh, correctively secure state okay all the loads are supplied without uh, violating any limits first point all the loads are supplied without violating any limits secondly if a contingency occur it does not cause um, any load loss if there is a contingency on any of the parameter okay load loss will never occur the load is supplied with a total of 100 sorry 10 megawatt if the load is 10 megawatt we are supplying the whole load of 10 megawatt there is no cut in the load okay if contingency do not cause any load loss contingency does not cause any load loss and we are uh, going to take uh, appropriate action for that and remember compared to secure level correctively secure level is more economical to operate remember this level is more economical than level 1 
which is secure correctively secure if a fault occur or if, if a contingency occur also we are not affecting the load here okay the load is supplied fully okay this is more economical than the secure state and third level third level is uh, alert level 3 is alert here load is supplied without violating any limits remember as of uh, our level 1 and level 2 here also in level 3 alert state also the load is a supply without violating any limits okay but when a contingency occurs the load or the loss of the load may occur remember in this case in alert case if a contingency if we are having we'll take a, the same example Two generators supplying a load of uh, 10 megawatt if it is for time being we'll change the parameters now 2 megawatt and uh, 8 megawatt if it is 8 megawatt here it is a 4 megawatt and 4 megawatt total load is uh, 10 megawatt if a contingency occur means if a fault occur in this line if a fault occur in this line the loss of load will occur which means we are not supplying a 4 megawatt we are supplying only 4 megawatt out of 8 megawatt here 2 megawatt total 6 megawatt is supplied a 4 megawatt of load is uh, not supplied here okay this is what we are talking of if a contingency occur occur some violations may cause load loss okay if fault occur means contingency occur means if a fault occurs this line may be overloaded which means this 4 megawatt to supply 10 megawatt we are overloading this uh, first line 4 plus 4 is 8 megawatt violation is occur or if we can't uh, overload this line only a 6 megawatt of uh, load can be supplied so we are saying if contingency occur some violations may cause load loss and remember since it is in uh, alert state we can uh, bring back to level 1 and 2 by preventive rescheduling we can bring back the system to secure state okay also to correctively secure state by preventing rescheduling by taking some measures we can bring back the system to normal state which is a secure and uh, correctively secure level okay this is about uh, alert level and our fourth level is uh, correctable emergency
fourth state is correctable emergency in this uh, level all the loads are supplied but uh, with operating limits violated for this we can take an example generator 1 with uh, 8 megawatt generator 2 with uh, 2 megawatt the load is uh, at bus 2 of uh, 10 megawatt each line is carrying uh, 4 megawatt each if a contingency occur if a contingency occur in this line here for the first line the load the power transfer is now 8 megawatt 4 megawatt and 4 megawatt both uh, is transferred through the first line itself which means the operating limits are violated the system is capable of transferring only 5 megawatt now we are loading it with uh, 8 megawatt totally the system parameters are violated now operating limits are violated but remember the load is supplied 8 megawatt and 2 megawatt the load is supplied but operating limits are violated power flow capacity is uh, exceeded by 3 megawatt now we are supplying load but with some violations and uh, these violations cannot be corrected remember these violations cannot be corrected without load loss These violations cannot be corrected without loss of load which means since the power transfer capability of this line is only 5 megawatt we are overloading it by 8 megawatt if we want to correct this uh, we need to lose the load which means if we are making it back to 5 megawatt for time being 5 megawatt we are not supplying the whole 8 megawatt 8 megawatt is generated and we are transferring only 5 megawatt 5 plus 2 is 7 out of 10 megawatt we are only supplying 7 megawatt 3 megawatt of load is a loss here we are not supplying 3 megawatt of load that's what we are talking these corrections cannot be corrected to correct this we need to accept uh, some loss okay and uh, here also we can uh, bring back uh, the system to alert state we can bring back the system to alert level by taking uh, corrective measures okay this state correctable emergency can be bring back to alert state by taking some uh, corrective measures okay this is about uh, level 4 and our uh, Level 5 is a non correctable emergency. Level 5 is a non correctable emergency. 
here also in non correctable emergency all the loads are supplied remember try to imagine uh, the previous uh, diagrams a two generators with a load okay for each case that would be very helpful here also all the loads are supplied with the violation of operating limits also all the loads we are, we are in the all the states we are always trying to supply the maximum percent of the load remember so we are supplying the load with the violation of operating limits okay this situation or this level the system can be corrected only by loss of load remember this can be corrected only by the loss of load this is a non correctable emergency and our last level is level 6 restorative last level is restorative level in this level operating limits are not violated remember since it is restorative we are not supplying any load remember the corrective measures are taking in this level whatever the previous contingencies occurred whatever may be the uh, violation of the limits occurred we are uh, taking care of those measures in this level previous five levels fault or maybe misleads is correcting in this level operating limits are not violated the system is operating with uh, loss of load the system is uh, operating with uh, the loss of load and uh, with this level we can bring back the system to level one and two from restorative level we can bring back the system to level one and level two remember level one is secure and level two is uh, correctively secure okay level one is secure and level two is uh, correctively secure Here in this level we are only trying to bring back the system from violate in part to the normal state in this state always the load is uh, disconnected from the supply which means uh, the loss of load is uh, occurred this is about uh, security levels of uh, power system if you have any doubts please do put a message on my dropbox i'll surely reply thank you we'll uh, catch up in our next video